I remember I was probably 10 or 11 years old when I realized I needed glasses to see well. And there, I remember when I was young, they were a nuisance, you know, because I, I wanted to run and I wanted to play. And, you know, it was just a, a they got in the way. And sometimes, you know, if we, if we were playing rough, you know, they would get bent or they would break. And sometimes the lenses that my mother didn't buy the most expensive ones that could hold up for heavy child play, even though the doctor, eye doctor said, you know, you should probably get a little bit heavier lens. And she said, I'm not going to spend that much money if they're just going to break. But anyway, I remember one time we were on a trip down to Florida to visit Uncle George. And we were had stopped at a motel or halfway down and something happened. I don't remember exactly how, but something hit the side of the glasses and the side piece broke and a little crack happened in the lens and anyhow the 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 piece wouldn't fit right and they would sit sideways on my face and it, they were even more of a nuisance at that point and you know in life you know when pain hits us and it it's a lot like those broken glasses that we we look at life through badly distorted lenses and it gives us almost a headache to look through those things and of course, when we got to Uncle George's, he had some old wire, and we wired these things up, and we got them fixed up until we could get back home again and go to the eye doctor and get them fixed. And it reminded me of Psalm 141, verse 8, where it says, Lord, I look to you for help. In you I take refuge. You see, seeing God clearly can help us when life's experiences happen to us. And it helps us see things more clearly. You know, when we turn our eyes to the Lord in times of pain and struggle, and when we experience hardships and stuff, it helps us see things more clearly. You know, it it's not like we're looking through those glasses that are, you know, skewed and bent and maybe have that cracked lens. It, it helps us see things in, in a clearer focus when we turn to the Lord. And during this time when things might be clearing up a little bit for us and uh, maybe we might be starting back worship again and such as that. I, I encourage you to turn even more to the Lord. Look to the Lord for your help. Seek the Lord even further during this time. Start to see things more clearly. Take these words to heart that I found this, le this week. Lord, when my world is out of control, remind me to focus on you, to rest in your arms, and to experience your never-ending grace. You see, when we do that, when we focus on Christ, it always puts everything else in perspective. You know, those are some great words of wisdom that we get. Every time we turn to God, it always seems to put things in perspective. And I hope that these words bring you encouragement this week. And I hope to see you again next week and maybe in church. Amen.